Hi, I'm Dr. Siddhi Chandra. I started in 2022. I'm an optometrist here at St. Hope Healthcare and I'm the Director of Specialty Services. I love the patients. I'm very lucky that I have amazing patients, but I'm also very fortunate to have an amazing team. They motivate me every single day. First thing I start off in the morning, I check in with the vision care manager, Amanda. We work very closely together. We discuss our tasks for the day, kind of see how we can help each other and see how the team is doing. The thing that I love most about working with Dr. Chandra would be her hard work and dedication and the quality of care that she provides for her patients. She comes in every day ready for work with a smile on her face and some coffee for everyone. And uh, we appreciate that side of her and also we appreciate that she stands up for us and she's uh, no matter what. After that, I check in with my tag, Tanisha. We go over the patient schedule to see the workflow, where it's tight, where it's heavy, where we can you know, have a little bit more extra time to work with patients and if there's any changes I can make. So I've learned so many things since I've been here. Um, I've worked with doctors, eye doctors for like 16 years, but with Dr. Chandra, she's not stuck in her ways she kind of goes with the flow, she helps us, and she makes sure that we learn a bunch of new things. So that's what I love about Dr. Chandra. So when I finish my visit, something I always tell my patients is that you can come back and see me anytime for anything. I related, of course. Um, I think a lot of patients have the misunderstanding that they can only come see me for an annual exam and then they have all these concerns and questions and they just bottle it up until the next annual. But if anything's going on with your eye health, I'm more than happy to help and you can always come back in to see me. The biggest thing is when patients come in, they're kind of afraid to see their doctors or nervous, but when they're with me, they're like, okay, all my stress is gone. I'm having a great time, but I'm also getting an eye exam. So that's always really important to me to enjoy your experience. I can guarantee the services provided here is why I would always tell a patient to come here. Uh, we have the best technology. We're screening for eye diseases. We're looking for glaucoma, diabetes. We really take it a step further. It's not a quick in and out visit. We're very invested in your eye health and it starts from, you know, our manager or our scheduler to your eye doctor, me or Dr. Wen doing your eye exam. And it ends with a great technician picking out glasses for you and it's what's best for your eyes. What I love most about my job is my patients. They're incredible. They're so full of life and they really make every day I come in worth it. What I hope to leave my patients with is a sense of community, more than just an eye exam, that we have a relationship, that we have a relationship with your family as well doing their eye exams, and we will continue to have one for years to come. My family came here in the 80s. They came from India, from the state of Maharashtra. They came here with big hopes and dreams, so that's how we ended up in the United States. I have two older brothers, one is in Tennessee, that was where I was born and raised, and the other one is in Galveston. They're definitely big role models in my life. The one in Galveston, I'm always bringing to St. Hope events, so if you haven't met him, you'll definitely meet him soon. He's a big fan of the Grape Escape. So my husband and I got married in 2020. Uh, it was COVID, so we unfortunately had to postpone our Indian wedding a couple of times before it happened, but then it did happen. It was a big Bollywood wedding. I had the traditional Indian red dress and it was a wonderful time. Our honeymoon was a little wild. We actually went to Rwanda, which is unexpected because people are like, oh, that's not very romantic, but it actually was very romantic. We got to meet the gorillas, the baby gorillas, so it was very cute. So I love going to yoga. That's something that's been a big part of my life. I recently went to puppy yoga, which was super fun. The puppies are adorable there, so you should definitely try it out. And I also started CrossFit again, which has been really fun. I go to CrossFit Central Houston, the box. So I'm a part of a few different organizations in the Houston community. One of them is Legs Houston, which is Ladies Executive Golf Society of Houston. Um, it's, it's been a great experience. I love meeting these women and very empowering. My culture is also really important to me, so I recently joined an Indian Bollywood dancing team. We are performing at the Bel Air Diwali Festival, so you should come watch us. Diwali is the biggest Indian holiday in Indian culture. It's kind of like Christmas for us. It's the festival of lights and uh, the celebration of good over evil. I love to cook. Anytime I'm on vacation, I'm always taking a cooking class. I love learning every cuisine, but I have been cooking a lot of Indian food recently. I think Bel Air is aware of that because they're always smelling my Indian food and like, can I have some? 
so I definitely need to cook for the clinic as well. I think the best feedback I've gotten from patients is you make my day better. You make it more positive. You're so cheerful. You're so, you know, supportive. And if I was to be remembered, I want to be remembered for helping people. You know, we all have hardships. We all have obstacles. But it's nice to have a listening ear or a hand to hold and someone to really help you get through that to make your day better. I would love to be remembered for that. At St. Hope, you're more than just a number.